Hello guys, welcome back to my channel for part number 20 of Let's Play The Sims 4 The Lux Life. I just wanted to go ahead and throw this quick little disclaimer um, out there really quick or just something I kind of wanted to get off my chest. I just looked at part 19 of The Sims 4 uh, Lux Life um, in comments not that long ago and I did see that a lot of you are confused as to why I don't have any CC in my game. So since the update's getting ready for I think the luxury party um, stuff or whatever it is coming out tomorrow or today actually, uh, today as of this video, um, there was just obviously a lot of updates getting ready for that and they were causing conflicts with my CC and I couldn't narrow it down to which one because I had a ton so I just removed it entirely. Um, I just want to throw this out there like it is my choice whether or not I want to put CC in my game. I don't understand why it has to be an issue or <laughs> I just didn't realize it was that much of an issue. I don't know. I don't understand. You know it's, it's my decision and yes I am going to be putting it back in just because I love it and I didn't take it out because I wanted to. I took it out because I had to. And another thing um some of you did not like Caitlyn's uh, outfit, and you know what? There are going to be lots of that in the future. Um, you're not going to always like everything that I do, and I'm not going to always like your suggestions. But the one thing that I ask of you, if you truly do um, want your suggestion or comment to be heard, there is no need for insults. There is no need to get nasty. Constructive criticism is welcome. But being rude or just like, you know, I don't know, trying to like make it a serious situation. I'm honestly, I'm not going to pay no mind to it. Um, I'm not, probably not going to take your suggestion. So I'm not going to pay any mind to your comment and I'm not going to take your suggestion. Just try to keep it positive, keep it moving. If you don't like something, give a suggestion. I'm totally all ears. That's what I'm here for. But I'm not going to tolerate people being rude over something as silly as custom content I'm just not so since you guys didn't really like her look I'm going to keep everything that I like because at the end of the day um I do have a say in what goes on in my LPs just as much as you do I like the outfit I'm gonna keep the outfit for now um I can also add in another outfit so we can compromise here <laughs> and I can add something to a little more of your guys's um idea of what Caitlyn Bailey would wear Okay, so the biggest thing was the hair. Not a fan of the hair. Totally cool. Um, I probably am going to, I was going for a more sporty look and I don't have to like sit here and like justify what I was going for at the end of the day. But I am going to keep that and probably just put her in some damn pigtails. I like her outfit. So let's go ahead and build um, a second outfit. Something a little more snooty. So this is like Caitlyn at home behind the scenes. You know, that sort of deal. Um, we're going to build Caitlyn. Um, Caitlyn's second outfit, which is going to be something a little more prim and proper and um, a little more, you know, a little more, I don't know how to say it, like snobby. And I wouldn't say snobby, but you know, whatever. I don't really know what kind of hair I would want her to go for um, or what kind of hair I'd want her to. Oh, I like this hair on her. So I probably will stick with this one here. I just think that is so damn gorgeous. And another thing, I played her down. <laughs> I played her down because I get so many comments of, your teenagers don't even look like teenagers, they look too old. So that was just another little like reason why she wasn't um, getting a lot of love, I guess. All right, I don't know what kind of outfit I want to give her, though. That's the thing. There's not a lot really here to choose from, and that is why I like CC. But um, I'm probably going to stick with maybe a nice pink leather jacket. I like that. Or even the off the shoulder kind of pinkish. Um, I don't know because she has she has a pink outfit already. So if I do, ooh, this red is gorgeous. I like this red on her. So I'm going to stick with that. Uh, I am probably going to give her just a little more makeup here. Um, something that's going to emphasis on her eyes a little bit. And um, here's a little bit of a light pinky tingy lipstick. I wonder if I have any of those or like something kind of pastel -y. Cause when I was in high school, I wore the most ridiculous frosted lips that you ever did see. Like it was a situation. It was a situation. Like it always looked like I just like had a whole bunch of powdered donuts or a bowl of frosted flakes or mini wheats or whatever the hell they're called. I'm dead serious. You guys like it was definitely definitely um, a situation in my day, but I don't know what kind of pants I want to give her. I like those uh, a little bit, but I wanted to give her something a little more, uh, let me see, these pants are okay, a little more edgy, I was thinking edgy, 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 yeah, those work, I like those actually, 
Um, those pants don't match, but they don't look that bad neither. Uh, I kind of like those pants too. Uh, I think I'm going to go with maybe, even though they don't really match, I just, I think, I don't know. I don't know how they think now. <laughs> Actually, I kind of like that. Okay, so we'll go with those. And I'm going to give her some nice shoes to kind of go with it. Uh, I like these shoes or maybe a brown would go nice or maybe nothing at all because I kind of don't know if I like any of those. I'll probably stick with these lighter brown shoes. So I like that a lot. That looks pretty pretty damn good um, in my personal opinion, of course. And then we're going to go and add in a third outfit, which is going to be a little more snooty as well or like super duper like classy, I guess. Uh, whatever my definition of classy is. I wonder what kind of dress I've got going on here. Do, do, do. Um, I don't know. I like this dress a lot, but <laughs> I think I use that a lot. I'm not 100% sure. Um, I like this dress too. This one's really, really, really pretty. I could do like a navy blue dress on her and then I can give her some stockings. I don't really know. Or I don't really remember what Faye is wearing actually. So I'm going to have to like double check that real quick. We can give her some bangles here. Um, or just a classy bangle like that one. I don't know if I like that one though. Here's just a plain black. Or we have some that go like this. This one matches a lot better than that one does. Okay, so cool. We'll go with that and then we're going to go ahead and uh, do some different shoes here. Which I'm going to give her some nice little flats. This is like definitely a more outgoing outfit for sure. Like this is like not something you would like wear probably to school. But knowing Mrs. Uh, Caitlin Bailey, she will totally rock this at school. Because uh, she is very like, I don't know. She has all different sides to her. I wonder if I have a hair up to that can go up because I kind of want to see her earrings. She's not really wearing any, but we can go ahead and give her some. Uh, there's these little guys that are pretty cute that dangle, but I don't know if I'm feeling those or not. A hundred percent anyway. I don't know. I kind of like those, but not really. All right, that actually looks pretty decent. And then for her necklace, I don't know if we have anything that would go with this too or that's just overkill. I don't know. I'm not really a fan of the necklaces. Um, okay, uh, right. All right, so that's pretty much where I'm going to keep it at. Again, if you really don't like an outfit, you can give suggestions. But there's really no need to be hasty, babe. No need to be hasty and nasty. I'm just saying because I ain't got no tolerance for that crap. We got to cut that ish out now. Just saying. <clears throat> got me all messed up inside. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, so uh, Faye actually starts work in one hour. And if you guys don't remember, she got a... um. Uh, what was it? A promotion previous part and she became a medical intern super exciting Let's get her into one of her new outfits All right, she she just walks past that dirty plate like ew girl. No bye girl. Bye Uh, where is the stinking things to change the outfits? Uh, what? Why is it so hard like oh cuz I'm not you well that would make a lot of damn sense Okay, change the outfit. We'll do every day two or something like that let's do that okay there she is she looks so cute um she's gonna eat the rest of her cake hey cake for breakfast like why the hell not you know what i mean we need to have her definitely um continue to get to know cora and she would like to critique something uh cora needs to get ready for school as well uh i don't know if there's any children bedrooms because like we really haven't um been working on Cora's room at all but let's go ahead and do that like really fast let's go see what we can find in here um if there's any children bedrooms or anything like that that would look kind of nice there's this one and I think it's actually uh, almost the perfect size I think I think it is it is it, it is the perfect size now do I love it uh, do I like it uh, it's not that bad, actually. I don't remember what the front of the house looks like, so we're just going to kind of go with it, I think. I don't believe it looked like that. I think it kind of looked like this. All right, and then we're going to put in some of these mirrors here, or these windows. I would assume possibly like that. Okay, and now is there trimmings or anything? Exterior trim. Where the hell did you find this at? Because that looks awesome. I swear, I can never find... These little, like, gadgets and gizmos and such. That looks so nice in here. Okay, whoa. What are we doing? All I want to do is have a little bit of fun before I die. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, do I just move this in here and then it should look good? 
Okay. I think I took something down with me, but that's okay. Um, now, I, 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 I've I never used one of these, like, pre-made sort of deals. I don't think I've used them um, that much anyways. Like, I just don't ever remember using this room before, so I don't know how this all works. But we're going to organize it a little bit so that we can get a... And get a door in here, obviously, because how is she going to make it inside? Now, let me check this out. Pretty in plaster. I feel like this looks very odd to have, like, a door like this that goes to another room like that. But I guess if that's the way the house is, then I guess that works. Down here, there were some blinds. Uh, we could go ahead and put those back in, I think, if you guys like those. I like them, too, but I just don't know why they would have gotten deleted. Now, let's go check in our inventory. Probably got a lot of stuff that's in here. Holy crap. Look at our inventory. So much stuff. Okay. Um, I do like this, so probably putting that in there and taking away this light makes a little more sense. Also, there is this bad boy here, and there we are. Okay. So now that we have all that, I think everything looks pretty decent. We have the girls' rooms and, and things like that. So we can go ahead and continue with what we were um, doing there. Now, our girl here, she's going to be going to school. Now, I'm going to double check and see if she uh, has done any of her homework or anything. Uh, I don't think she has exactly. But again, we really want Caitlin to be extremely... Um, prestigious and and focus in on her school we're gonna go ahead and actually join in on um phase job or whatever the case is so again i just i really want you guys to 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 let me know your deeper and most inner thoughts on um hank and and they and zane do we think that zane is going to be somebody Faye is going to marry to the altar i don't i don't know she's starting to to learn every day a little more that um that He's not the person she thought, but then again, she just wants to so desperately be married and move on with her life and, you know, help raise Caitlyn because she loves Caitlyn and, you know, all that kind of stuff, like, as I've said before. So it's really hard for her, or not her, it's really hard for our girl here to, like, let things go. Um, so after work, she's actually going to go visit her sister because it's been a while. And I do think we're going to have to go fix Carrera because Carrera, she'd be ball headed. And I'm not sure if I ever did get a chance to make her over or not. Or not. Nah. I don't know. No, definitely not. She's she's naked. All sorts of nah. Nope. She's naked. We need to continue to like be all about that business because um all about that base because it's it's been a minute since we've seen her. And, you know, I think we should spend time with her sister. A lot of you guys, again, want me to bring her back, and I'm not bringing her back right now. Um, hopefully sometime in the near future, that would be really cool. But for right now, she's bettering herself. So uh, I like how Faye hasn't done a damn thing. <laughs> she hasn't been working or anything like that. Uh, I want to do an x-ray scan. So we need to admit some butty. I don't know if I can actually x-ray scan. Okay, refer for x-ray scan. Cool. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Our very first x-ray scan. Are you guys excited? I have never seen this interaction before. I like the way she walks. She's so damn sassy. So sassy. Um, but I'm, I'm really excited. Okay, so she looks like she's typing in some stuff. This guy looks very confused. Probably the same face I would have. This is like the stuff that they have in that freaking airports. It's terrifying. It's terrifying. It's so terrifying. Um, but yeah. All right. Do we find anything? I don't know. <laughs> I see your Ouija's. <laughs> no, just kidding. Oh, whoa. All right. Anything happening? I don't I don't notice anything. I don't know if we're... Something's smoking. Is that my pits? Oh, no joking. My pits are smoking. Okay. Can we please, like, figure out what we're doing here? All right, cool. Um, Faye has successfully performed a practice on a patient. The test results seem valid, but the specific data is a bit over her head. <gasps> oh, but I was... Uh, what? I scanned. Am I scanning the wrong person? I just scanned his body and it doesn't count. Well, what is that crap? That is crap. That is utter crap. Like, seriously, that is so much crap. I can't even tell you how much crap that crap is because it's so much crap. Are you freaking serious right now? Oh, you're, oh, you're serious. Oh, my God. I don't want to cry. Like that, I, I'm going to be a big fat baby because that's just a little bit ridiculous. Over my head, my Nicolito. Huh, whatever. We're gonna swap a sample. I'm over this life. Um, let me see if there's anyone else here. Is this? I swear to God, I really think that's Cora. Um, let me go and admit this chicky here. Medical referral. Uh, admit to 
I want to refer to x-ray scan. See, this isn't working. I'm not stupid anymore. I, I learned, okay? Friendly introduction here. And we need to greet one more patient. This work day, I don't think it could get any worse. She's over here freaking chatting the damn ears off of this poor soul. And uh, not doing any of her job. Like, she's just she's just sucking today. I think the whole thing with with uh, Mr. Smoothskins is starting to really get on her, um, get on her, like, on her, not on her mind, but, like, it's starting to get on her nerves a little bit. I don't know. She's starting to, like, it's starting to affect her work. That is what I'm trying to say. It is starting to severely affect her work, actually. Um, because she's just constantly thinking about it all the time. And uh, rightfully so. Like, it kind of makes sense, I think, anyway. So, let's go over and go to the bathroom because, obviously, she's really got to go. It's quite obvious we're probably going to have to stay late to make up this freaking, um, extra hours. Because we haven't even, like, gotten, uh... Yeah, we haven't even got like a freaking any of it, any of it, not even a bronze. So let's just have her go and uh, work on some health reports really fast. It's something quick and easy she can do. She needs to analyze a patient's sample as well. Uh, obviously, this is very dirty, so we have to clean it. I don't know the last time that we've cleaned these machines. It's been quite a while. I wish that was one of the things that we had to do. Uh, we are going to analyze a bio sample from Philip. And see what those results yield, of course. Oh, poor Faye. Zane is off to work. Yay! Go make a paycheck, son. Please. Thank you. All right, work hard. <laughs> I hope he does. Okay, we uh, got a complete analysis. Now we need to go and deliver some food to a patient's bed. So we're going to go and deliver the food. We're going to take a swab sample from this guy over here. No, we already did this. Just joking. We will not be doing that. Uh, I guess we're going to have to admit somebody else. So let me do that, and I'll admit to the exam bed. She's feeling focused. That's great, because you need to be. You've got a couple hours on the clock, and you're only at a bronze level. Like, that is pretty bad, dude. Pretty bad. Like, really bad. Can we just... I love this rug. Did I ever mention that? Like, I freaking love the rug. So I the Lux pack is supposed to be coming out today. I'm filming this a day before, by the way. Um, so I'm filming this on Monday and a pack comes out on Tuesday, which <laughs> coincidentally is the same day that hubby's off. And you know how I feel about filming when other people are around and I just don't know what it is. It's just, it, I just, I have to have, I have to have Zen, like I have to be focused. You know what I mean? But uh, I'm probably going to either have it up today. Hopefully I like how you're using the clean machine that I just cleaned instead of cleaning this one, you little snatch. Anyways, I'm going to hopefully get the review up uh, for you guys today. If not, it'll be up tomorrow. Um, either way, you know, it'll be up. I'll definitely have it for you guys. But I would much rather it for it to be today. And you will be getting two videos today as well, regardless of if it comes up or not. It'll just be like a bonus. But, um, yeah, I'm really excited. I thought it'd be cute to do, like, a, a luxury party slash Lux Life video on the same day. I don't know. I just... I don't know. I think it'd be kind of cool. Kind of cool. We need to practice bioanalysis. Okay, so we've got... Oh, I screamed in your ears. I know. We've got all these, like, things to do and very little time. I said practice analysis. Don't sit here and sass... What? Yeah, 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 yeah. Too stinky or something? I don't understand. What are we doing? Practice? Oh, you... Oh, oh you... Oh, oh, oh. Oh. She's getting on ring. Well, this, that, then fine. You know what? You're going to have a shooty paycheck and it's going to be your freaking problem and it ain't going to be my problem. Let's go refer this dude to the scan and see if, oh my gosh, we don't even have time, whatever. Oh my gosh, whatever's. I'm over this. I'm over this. Just please, please. I'm begging you sweetly. Just let me get, it's not going to, it's not, huh? It's not. Damn. Double dam, like triple dam. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Well, meh. You know, we did earn 224 simoleons, which is obviously not a lot of money when you have two children and, and things like that. So, I don't know. You guys really want Faye to have a baby with Zane? And I think that would be a good idea because Faye doesn't have any children. <laughs> But I don't know if I want it with Zane or not. I haven't decided yet. What do you think? Zane or no Zane? Like, we'll be making some moves pretty soon. So you got to let me know. Do, should we have a baby with Zane or should we have a baby with Hank? Because I, I, I'm not going to tell you what the drama is going to be uh, tied with either of them. But you let me know in the comments down below. Right now, Hank or Zane? 
baby. Which one? Do we want a baby with Hank? Or do we want a baby with Zayn? I don't know. It's it's crazy. You just got... Well, it's crazy like Zayn. But you just got to let me know. So I think our little chickadee's home. Obviously, she's talking to Cora right now. Uh, with the, She has like a glass of orange juice. Um, I don't know how school's going or she's met anyone. I love how everybody is like topless. This is beautiful. Um, she has a really good relationship with... Uh, with her dad pretty much it's her mom she's still got to get to know um i think a little bit more so let's have her work on some homework i would like her to like be able to meet more kids at school and and stuff like that uh, i think that'd be really really nice so i want cora to um go ahead and like clean up a little bit and then i'm gonna have her work on her homework actually i think she's already done it i would be impressed no she did she's such a smart little girl i love her uh, I'm going to have her go clean up and then she's going to use the restroom. And then after that, we're going to have her practice on her piano because this is so important that I, I really want her to be like super, super um, talented and, and, and being able to like do the music stuff. So I think it'd be really cool for her. She's such a little helper. I love it. Um, so what is, where's, where's Faye? Faye's exhausted. She's had enough today. I think we're going to have her go ahead and go to sleep just a little bit earlier. Zane's working really hard, which is nice because we need the income. We need it really bad. Um, I was going to have her visit her sister, but for some reason, I just don't think that's going to happen today. So in the next part, once I get some CC, I am going to um, edit her so she's not running around naked. <laughs> and who knows? We could probably use some of the new Lux Life stuff. But look at this stack of freaking plates that she's got going on. I don't understand how they can do so well. Like they, they got it really like just piled high here. Um, I want her to get a boyfriend. I really do. I just, I don't know. I just think that would be kind of fun. And look how beautiful their backyard is. Like, oh my god. It's so nice back here. Super jealous. Super, super, super jealous. Um, I think Cora is just going to go and use the bathroom and then do what she needs to do. Um, maybe we can have uh, Caitlin chat on the computer for a little bit when she's finished with her homework. Which, of course, I'm not sure she's almost done. She should be. Um, I think she's almost done. And it's still sunny outside, too. That's nice. Uh, well, a little bit, right? It's starting to. It's like twilight. Twilight zone. Where's my girl? She's working on her piano. Yeah. I love her earrings. She's so cute. Um, okay, are you done yet, Boom? Are you done? Okay, so she is just about done. Zane got promoted to locker room attendant. And all I know is I see this guy out here. And who is he? It's Alexander Goss. Interesting. He is a teenager. Wouldn't that be cool to see Alexander and uh, our girl getting um, together? Because he is prestigious. Remember, he has the money, honey. She would totally be all about that life. Like, dead serious, being part of the goths. I know we always go for these dark, doll, dark, tall, dark, tall, dark, tall. Oh my god, what the hell? Dark, tall, and handsome. Ah, whatever you know what i'm trying to say i always go for the same like guys i, I swear but anyway um caitlin just wants she's, she's you think carrera's bad <laughs> you haven't seen nothing yet i'm just saying you think she's bad uh-uh she would be she's the kind of girl that's like oh zane you don't want to stay in this family oh daddy daddy but please i don't want to be broke just stay with her daddy Mm-hmm. That kind of girl. Mm-hmm. That kind of girl. Seriously. Bad news written all over the place. So, um, we will continue to get to know Mr. Alexander. I know, I, I, I don't know. What do you guys think about him? Just, I'm telling you, she has an uh, ulterior motive for sure. Uh, I'm actually going to have her kind of go and get ready to go to sleep because it's kind of getting late here. Uh, Zane is going to call Charlene. If he can, I was going to actually have, uh, wait, he wants to be friendly with Faye. Um, he's going to call Charlene just to kind of check in on her and make sure that she's okay and everything's good and kind of give it an update on Caitlin, 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 Caitlin. And I think our little boo here is going to get for just a little bit and kind of enjoy her night. She's been pretty much sleeping all morning, which is kind of unfortunate. Um, we're just going to drag some of this stuff over here so she doesn't have to really worry about putting it away because it's just unnecessary. I'm going to have her cook up something, though, because she's always kind of liked that cooking jig. So serving some good dinner would be nice. Uh, we're going to serve. Ooh, we're going to serve some herb crusted chicken. 
which I know is crazy to do at night, but I really want to see what this plate looks like. It sounds delicious. And um, where are you going exactly? She's going to go to the bathroom, okay? Um, she's thinking about school and homework, and Zane's actually still talking to, to Kate, uh, to Cheyenne. What? Cheyenne, right? Charlene. I don't know what it is with the names lately, but I'm like starting to freaking brain fart a little bit. Um, oh my god, you have no pants on. I still haven't put pants on you? <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so let's go and, uh, change his pants, I guess. Wow. That is funny. I didn't even realize that he still had no pants. The poor man has no pants. Alright, so let's go and get him some damn pants. I wonder what other outfits I could get of him. Uh, I, I think we just put this one on him. I think we're gonna even wrap up this part here in just a split second after we're done with this, but, uh, I don't know what kind of pants I'm gonna put on him then, because I feel like he kind of goes with the flow a little bit. He is just more of a, kind of like a grown adult guy that just dresses like a child. That's his first outfit, and then his next outfit, we're gonna put him into something, uh, a little more, like, definitely more bro. Like, total bro. Like, bro all the way. Um, I can see him wearing, like, pants like that or something, like, you know, just not face type at all. Faye's maturing a lot, and I don't think Zane is, um, and I mean, I, you know. They are engaged now, though, by the way, so I should probably get her, uh, to wear an engagement ring. So I had a beautiful one before the CC got taken out, like a baby, out of the womb. It's just so sad. We're gonna go and put this one in. Or uh, put that one on. Actually, no, I really like the other. Yeah, there we go. There we go. So now she has an engagement ring and Zayn has pants. So, so far we are definitely winning in this part. But I'm not exactly sure how uh, long it's been um, precisely. But what I do know is I'm actually going to go ahead and wrap up this part right here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to go ahead and comment, rate, and subscribe. But please do uh, let me know. Whether you think that our girl here should have a baby with Zane or Hank. Uh, again, I will figure out the drama part of it all. But you just make the decision. <laughs> Alright. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Don't forget to go ahead and comment, rate, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below where the sun does shine. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.